My name is Caleb. If there's one thing I've learned in life, it's that sometimes grace can get messy. Let me tell you what I mean. When I was two, my parents divorced. Then they both came out of the closet. Yep, my mom and dad are gay, both of them. My childhood was messy. I spent most weeks with my dad and he was very quiet about his sexuality. I spent weekends and breaks with my mom and she was not quiet about her sexuality. She met a woman named Vera and they ended up moving to Kansas City. And it wasn't too long before they were fully immersed in the LGBT community. They joined the local board of directors for GLAAD. They took me with them to parties and campouts and clubs. As a kid, I even marched in gay pride parades. I remember at the end of one of these parades, there were some Christians who were holding up signs on street corners. These signs said things like, Jesus has no room for you. If that wasn't offensive enough, they were spraying water and urine on everyone. I remember looking at my mom and being confused as a young kid. I asked her, Mom, why are they acting like this? And she said, well, Caleb, they're Christians. And Christians hate gay people. Growing up, I saw how some Christians treated people in the LGBT community. I watched as people who had AIDS were shunned by their family. I listened as radio preachers spewed homophobia and hate towards the gay community, and I knew that I never wanted the name Christian to be associated with me. Funny enough, when I was in high school, I joined a Bible study to learn how to disprove the Bible, and instead, I ended up following Jesus. When I graduated from high school, I went to Bible college. And after college, I worked for several years at a church in Los Angeles before moving to Dallas, Texas to preach. My mother's partner had died a few years earlier, so she moved to Dallas to be closer to our family. My dad moved a few months later. Both my parents started attending the church where I was preaching. Both of my parents gave their lives to the Lord, which is incredible. Do they believe in Jesus? Yes. Are they Christian? Yes. Do they still struggle with same-sex attraction? Yes. Are they judged by some Christians still? Probably. Do they believe the same as me on every theological issue? No. Is God with them on the path they're walking? Yes. How do all these things go together? I don't know. I just know that sometimes grace can get messy. And that's okay, because God loves messy people.